Hey y'all, hey family, how y'all doing? Happy Sunday. Hey y'all, it's your girl Tiana I can only be me, and I am coming at you with a live tutorial today on how to make my favorite soup. One of my favorites. I don't know about you, but it's my favorite. It is a copycat soup from Olive Garden. The name of this soup is called Zupa Tuscan Soup. To Zupa Tuscana soup, however you want to say it, is the Zupa soup, y'all. Okay, so if you like Zupa soup and you want to know how to make this Zupa soup with some homemade, well, we ain't gonna really do so much of home. Now, nah, we ain't gonna do the homemade garlic bread, but we're gonna make some homemade garlic bread because I gotta cook it and I gotta put my garlic butter on them. Okay, so it's gonna be homemade, and I'm also gonna be making a homemade cheesecake today. No baked cheesecake at that. Alright, so I want to say welcome, welcome, welcome to all my new subscribers and welcome back to all my faithful lawyer family members. I hope y'all is having a great day on today. Let's get into this video. Oh, first thing I ask is that you ring the doorbell. When I say ring the doorbell, that means hit the thumbs up the like button one time one for the one time for your girl. If you don't mind, if you was a new family member over here, I ask that you hit that red button on this side right there. Yep, you got to hit the X right there. If you was in a live chat, but hit that red button right there to the right, and that's gonna um um that's how you subscribe to the channel and become a family member. Also, one more thing that I ask you to do is hit that notification bell. The notification bell is right here on this side too. Hit that notification bell one time for the one time. It'll set your notifications for my channel so you'll be notified each and every time I come live. Or I upload a video. With all that being said, y'all, let's get into this video. What's up, family? Hey, Jocelyn. What's up, my sister book? Hey, hey, Keisha. Hey, Burnell. Burnell. Hey, uh, Didi. Hey, uh, Davisha. Lynette. Reese Perry. Hey, y'all. How y'all doing today? What y'all got going zone? What y'all got? <laughs> what y'all got? Y'all ready for this uh, recipe, honey? I know I am. First of all, let me go ahead on and get my little stuff out. Y'all know I'm, I want to I have this for in order real quick, like, for whoever going to come and watch this video, y'all. So just give me a second, okay? This for the replay part. All right. So what you're going to need is some... Um, Italian sausage. You can use the hot, but I have mild Italian sausage. So I got two packs of those. You're going to need you some potatoes. Some potatoes. And I'm going to use the Idaho rusty potatoes. You're going to need you some. Oh, I got another roll of sausage. Just, just a regular roll because I want extra meat in mine. You're going to need you some bacon, an uh, onion, you're going to need you some bacon, an uh, onion, and heavy cream, okay? So you're going to need you, depends on how much you're going to make, I recommend you just get the big box of it, but I know how much I'm making, so I'm going to, that's why I got this little one. And then the bacon, it's up to you if you want to use the real bacon big crumbles. Or if you want to cook your bacon yourself and crumble it up. So you're going to need you some bacon and a whole pack of bacon and crumble it up, okay? Then you're going to need you an onion and you're going to need you some garlic. Minced garlic or fresh garlic, like I said, that is up to you as well, okay? So this is, and then you're going to need you some kale. You're going to need you a box or some pre-made chicken stock but i'm gonna do my own chicken stock so you could buy the box chicken stock to save you some time if that's what you want to do it's up to you and about telling you what to do because it's your stuff you do what you want to do with your stuff okay you can also add red pepper flakes to it and stuff like that or like i said you could buy the spicy sausage if that's what you want to do but i also got some parmesan cheese and we're gonna grate this parmesan cheese to go on top of it when it's done y'all okay so i'm gonna put that back in the refrigerator now the kale if you want to buy the kale and you cut it up yourself and you um 
you don't do all you need to do with the kale and stuff like that, then that's up to you. But I bought a bag of kale. Mine's is over in the water. It's soaking in salt water. And I picked the stems out of it. And mine's is already bagged up like this from Walmart, y'all. Okay, so just in case y'all was wondering. All right, so now that's the ingredients you're gonna need your large stock pot or some kind of pot because you know when you get to making soups and stuff, uh -oh. when you get to making soups and stuff soups get tend to um tend to start uh bulking up real real quick so hold on y'all let me get my little area together real quick right here but i hope y'all is having a good day today my day is starting off real good, y'all. I thank the Lord that he allowed me to see another day. Open his eyes, honey, shine light on me. Okay? Because he did not have to. He did not have to allow me to see another day. But he said, you know what? I'm going to let my Tiana see another day. Because she mean that much to me. I'm going to let her be here another day. So I told the Lord this morning when I got up, and I think I told him two times, thank you. Thank you for letting me see another day because he didn't have to let me see that day. So I am grateful to be here on this side and not having no one mourning over me on the day, you know? So what is y'all thankful for today? Y'all thankful? Is y'all anybody, anybody on here? not thankful if you ain't i hope by the end of this video you feel some kind of encouragement some kind of excitement i hope you're not sad you know going through whatever whatever but by the end of this video i pray that y'all be feeling a whole lot more better because that's what your sugar boo is here for to show you how to cook some good food and also to entertain you okay and i'm gonna do just that all right, so I had to get my stuff put up real quick. Hold up, y'all. Okay. You woke up for exactly, girl. Got to. You got to, honey. Thank you, boo. <laughs> Girl, don't get me started. Okay. Don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't get me started. Y'all ring the doorbell. Ring the doorbell. If you want the ones that can't, uh oh, we got 22 people in here, 17 people run the doorbell. Thank y'all for ringing the doorbell. For those of you that run the doorbell, if you don't know what the doorbell is, the doorbell is the thumbs up, the like button. Please hit it. One time for the one time. For your girl. For your sugar boo. If you don't mind ringing the doorbell for your girl one more time. Hey, if you don't mind ringing the doorbell. For your girl, one more time, one more time. If you don't mind, ringing the doorbell. For your girl, one more time. Okay, that is all I ask you to do is ring the doorbell, honey. If you need me to go on, on and go on, on and show you it, tell you about it one more time. Okay, just one more time. I got you, sugar. So just put the ding on the dome and ring the doorbell. Put the ding on the dome and ring the doorbell. Put the ding on the dome and ring the doorbell. Put the ding on the dome and ring the doorbell. I thank y'all for ringing the doorbell because now you don't run the doorbell. So that must mean that you're liking me so far. So let me go ahead on and introduce myself. Hey y'all, it's your girl T on a, I can only be me. Hey, y'all, it's your girl, it's your girl, it's your, your sugar 
sugar, 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 boo. I can only be me. Amazing day and amazing day. Who, how many of y'all? 33. So that means 10 of y'all didn't ring the doorbell yet. Okay. So let me, what's up? Uh, hold up, y'all. Hold up. One time for the one time. One time for the one time. Two times for the one time. Hold up. Hey, Davisha. So glad you came on feeling a little down on that sugar. I know you're going to spread that love and positive energy. Just pray for me, y'all, and thank you kindly. I will, but to be sure, you already know I'm going to get you all the way together. Okay, you're going to feel a little bit more better. I hate that you're feeling down, but that's all right. We got our days, you know, so it's okay as long as you don't carry that, that, just that down feeling all day today, you're going to be all right. Okay, just go and get rid of it. Okay, thank you, um, um, Adri Adriana, Mas Mas hey. Don't charge some hard, honey. Charge to honey. Your sugar boo just can't say it. Y'all welcome Adriana to the family. I'm happy to have you, Adriana. Uh, who else? Hold on. What's up, Cam? Hold on, y'all. I got to go back up real quick. There go 5150. Bang. What up, I love you too, sister. Listen, they say what 5150 mean. They want to know. They mean we at you. We at you all the way 100. You feel me? He, he, said, he, he said we at you. Okay, who else? Let's you know we out here, man. Yes, thank you, Lord. Hold on, thank I God for mercy. This 51, 51, 50. All right, let me read we're coming real quick. Yes, thank God for, for mercy this morning because he didn't have to do it. He touched us with the finger of love and woke us up this morning. Thank you, Jesus. Okay, that's right, Miss Vernell. You look so pretty. I love your dress looking sexy. You go, girl. Thank you, Didi Boo. Hey, Miss Moper Life. How you doing, Boo? Welcome to the family. Y'all welcome, Miss Moper Life, to the family. If there's anybody else new in here, please let me know so that I can go ahead on and welcome y'all to the family. But only thing I'm finna go ahead on to tell y'all right now is today is one of those days that i be in the kitchen cooking i'll be doing my little thought feels and honey be getting down with it okay so i can't entertain y'all you know um by talking with you and stuff like that reading all of your comments i don't like for nobody to go ignore but some people somebody gonna get ignored today okay so let me just go on and let you know that right now so you won't be getting all in your feelings and stuff Okay, I don't mean to ignore you, but honey, I gotta get my dinner done, honey. Okay, so I'm just, I just had to let y'all know that. Listen, today ain't one of the days where I'll be able to see everything, but I will be able to see you in and out. Okay, all right. So, so what up? Who else? Hey, Miss Yvette. Hey, um, Jan the bear, the the barrels. How you doing, boo? Come on in, sugar. Hey, Sandra Romero. How you doing, boo? Hey, uh, Latasha girl. Hey, Miss Beatrice. Good to see you, sugar. Hey, Miss Marsha. I'm doing good, girl, honey. Feeling feeling lovely today. Okay. What's up, Cam TV? It's good to see you. Tell your brother, cousin, whoever he is. Damn TV. I said, hey, what's up, Zaya? Hey, Laurie. Hey, Miss Deborah. How you doing? You knew I love to watch you and your family from Hammond. I don't know where LA is, honey. Is it Los Angeles? Oh, if it is, don't don't judge me. I ain't the only one that don't know. Okay. All right, so y'all welcome Miss uh, Deborah Davis to the family. I'm happy to have you, Miss Deborah. I hope you feel at home, okay? But every time y'all come by here, you must put a ding on the dong and ring the doorbell. If you don't know what that is, that's thumbs or the like button, okay? And we sugar bulls over here to one another, all right? I'm glad you do, Sandra. <laughs> it's feeling good as hell. I know that's real, honey. That's a good thing. I'm gonna be fine now. I'm getting this positive. That's right, Miss Davisha. Hey, uh, GE, good to see you, boo. Hey, the invisible chef, uh, chef, welcome back, love. What's up, my girl, Latika? Hey, Ava, sugar, boo. Y'all coming through today. Y'all better. 
Who else? Hey, Shanita. Just got done watching my prank girl won a good child. Honey, it backfired them. If y'all didn't see that prank video that I put out, y'all please go and show that video some love, okay? Honey, I ain't, listen, I can't tell y'all about it, but it was a water prank that I did on my husband, y'all. And it just backfired a little bit. So I want y'all to go on and watch that video for me. And I'm gonna try to get some more pranks out of y'all. All right. So, all right, y'all. So let's get into the video now. I love y'all. I hope y'all is having a good day today. I hope y'all enjoy me and stuff like that. Can y'all hear the background music now? I'm gonna finna be a little quiet. How can your name be blue? Um, I'm not really giving out no more mods at the moment. I'm not giving out moderators. Hey, Kendra, how you doing, sugar? No, I ain't finna. I don't know what that is, but uh-uh. Eh, okay. <laughs> don't spoil it. Don't spoil it. I'm glad y'all enjoyed it. I sure will. I'll tell her. Hold on. Grandma, everybody said hey. Huh? Tell us, say hey. Okay, y'all. What we eat, and we gonna have some. Okay, so for everybody that's coming in, what I am cooking today is Zupa Toscana soup. Zupa Toscana soup is a soup that is very popular at Olive Garden. This is an Olive Garden soup that I'm making. It is one of my favorites, y'all. And they serve it with, they have like super salad days, but they serve it with breadsticks and stuff. Child, honey. When I tell you, honey, you make these breadsticks to go with it, <laughs> garlic bread chai. And then you take that garlic, that juice from that soup, honey, and just dab your bread. Ooh, girl. All right, child, you ain't gonna know what had done slapped you, but the topping on all child. Let me tell you what I'm making with it, girl. I'm making the no bake homemade strawberry cheesecake. Drop the mic on them, child. Drop the mic on them. They don't even know. They don't even know. Hold on, y'all. for y'all so y'all can see down in the pot y'all i know i like for y'all to see and stuff like that honey you gotta get in the in the like swim well honey when i um do these recipes and stuff give you some honey you gonna get some you best know you is how you doing uh young blood welcome to the family i hope you come over and enjoy hey miss gab girl Hey, Miss Gail Sugar. How you doing? Hey, beautiful 71. Coming over for dinner piece of blessings from Kansas City, Missouri. And welcome to the family, beautiful 71. I'm happy to have you, Sugar. Y'all welcome, beautiful 71, to the family. Listen, who else? Yes, they can. Come on, child. Bring them all. Okay. Lil Johnson said, child, you already know it's finna go down, don't you? What's up, Jonathan? I think I done seen you here before and done welcomed you to the family. But, uh, good to see you back. If you the same one, I think I, re I remember your name, though. I do. I do remember your name. What's up, my sugar lean girl? 
What you doing, girl? Okay, y'all. <laughs> What's up, my boo, Danielle? What's up, Brenda? Brian coming through. I hope you ain't got no game on today, Brenda. Now you made pecan caramel cheesecake. Oh, girl, that sound good. I ain't never had that neither, honey. You need a honey. Hey, Miss Valerie, come on in, sugar. Hey, Kendall girl. Who else? Hold on, y'all. Let me get you real quick. What's up, Lucia? Hey, Miss Doreen. Hey, Miss Ella. I... God dang, Brenda. Nah. You about to... Let me tell you something. You... What you said? You finna make... I'm finna try to do it, honey. I'm finna try. Okay. I'm glad you is, Miss Gail. It's good to see you today. You been in walk? Oh, glad. Oh, okay. I'm glad you is here, girl. Hey, Miss Christine. Thank you, sugar. Girl, don't make my teeth fall out, honey. Blushing, child. Okay. <laughs> All right, child. Let's get into the video because, honey, I ain't going to never get to cooking. Mess with y'all. All right. So, listen. Everybody that's coming in here, if you're new, welcome. How, listen, y'all ain't tell me how the music sound in the background. Is it too loud? Is do I need to turn up a little bit more? I don't need y'all be hearing Bay up in there, honey, shooting them up, honey. Okay? Cause that's what he doing. Be so happy. I'm, I am be happy to see you too, girl. <sighs> it's 51 people in here and 46 on the doorbell. If you one of the ones that's in the number that didn't ring the doorbell, please, I love you too, boo. Please ring the doorbell for your girl. Hey, Miss Kathleen, one time for the one time. If you don't mind, I'm getting the doorbell for your girl one more time. Hey, you better. Okay. Thank y'all. Thank you. <laughs> All right. So let's get into it, y'all. And we ain't going to never get started. I'm going to be over here singing my little heart out. Thank you, Miss Christine uh, Williams. Oh, thank you, sugar, and welcome to the family. Y'all welcome, Miss Christine. As y'all see new people in here, as you always do, y'all please welcome them to the welcome them to the family. Fuck me if y'all don't mind. Okay, sugar, please. All right, y'all, and, and speak to the people for me, please, y'all. Y'all don't be rude. Speak to the people as they come in, cause I know if y'all go somewhere on somebody else's channel and you go in and they see you coming in there and they see you speak. And you don't speak to them, then that make them feel some type of way. So y'all speak to the people as they come in. Don't be rude, cause you don't want to go. You y'all 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 welcome the family in y'all house. This y'all house too. So y'all welcome the family in y'all house. Okay. All right, y'all. So first thing we finna do is get the uh, washing and cutting up these taters and onions and all that good stuff. All right, so I'm going to show y'all how the taters are supposed to be cut up. I need to get them rinsed off and rinse around. I'm going to pick out some good ones so I ain't got to be doing all that scrubbing to them and stuff. Then I don't think I got to do is just put them in my water and just, just wash them. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put a lot of potatoes in mine, y'all. You could put about five, six potatoes in yours. Depends on how big you're going to make yours. But I'm going to put a lot of potatoes in mine because... My husband, he loves potatoes, y'all, okay? So, we gonna put probably all these potatoes in here because with this type of soup, y'all, it cooks down. The potatoes, it cooks down, and so you ain't gonna really have a lot of whole potatoes in it. That's not what you're gonna be going for with this type of soup, y'all, okay? So, yes, I could have prepared stuff. And all of that. So, if y'all is new here, let me go ahead on and, and tell y'all about my channel, y'all. Over here on my channel, y'all, we love to, to have a good time. And we and we do cooking vlogs, y'all. We don't do cooking shows. You want to know why? Because over here, honey, I got to cook the food, food, prep the food, and serve y'all the food. And show y'all how to, how to cook it, too. Oh, honey, and then you think when I'm done, you finna go. Oh, uh, you got another thing coming for sure. 
honey. Uh-uh, baby. Y'all sit here through all the process, honey. You learn how you cook and clean and, and clean your kitchen and all that good stuff all at the same time over here on my channel. So let me just go on and, 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 and forewarn you, honey. If this ain't just no cooking show. I'm going to be cooking my stuff and throwing all my love trash in the sink and uh -uh, child. Oh, <laughs> what you and building up dishes and and waiting on y'all to leave Who, what y'all thought this was what did you thought it was or what did you think it is honey okay so anywho let me get it started we're gonna i'm gonna take this little end piece right here and i and i and i want skin in mine y'all and so let me show you how thick you got one your potatoes you want them to be on a little thick side like this, y'all. And I'm leaving skin on mine because I like the skin on my potatoes. Okay, so you're going to cut them by this thick, not too thin. You want to know why? Because, like I said, this soup here is going to break down. Okay? It's going to break down. So when it breaks down, you still want a little firmness. Of, you want tenderness, but you want firmness to the potatoes. Okay? So we're just going to get these here cut down like so and try to get them in a way um even portions now i ain't gonna cut all the butts off my potatoes honey because before there was the potato there was the butt okay honey the butt is part of the potato honey as long as ain't nothing wrong with it honey you better throw that on in there okay i ain't trying to tell you not to honey because over here on my channel honey if you don't know how to save and conserve you're gonna learn today Oh, yes, you're you going to learn today, honey. Waste not, want not, right? Okay. Shoot, by the time you get down to the last little bit of this soup, honey, it might not be nothing but butts in that pot. And you're going to be thankful to have them butts, okay? You best you best to know you will, honey. So, y'all, this soup right here, I, I don't think it's in no kind of way healthy, y'all. I really don't, since we have to use a cream in it. So, and it's a heavy cream at that okay and then it got all these taters in it and stuff like that honey but y'all you think y'all okay i ain't even got to explain no further because what's understood ain't got to be explained okay listen you do you over in your kitchen and i'm doing me over here in mine okay all right just let you know all right so i'm happy to have y'all here today though on this good sunday god oh god so good y'all i'm telling you god is so good we we think we got problems but you know what i'm saying we, we might have them problems but at the end of the day the problems must not be that bad in god's eyes you want to know why because he let you he let you stand to go through it another day everything that we go through y'all everything there's nothing that happens that is that is not meant to be a, a lesson to be learned behind it okay so don't take your problems your situation whatever it is that you're going through on today as something bad all the time y'all because sometimes god let us go through these things because he's talking to us he's trying to get our attention he's trying to tell you something he's trying to it's something that you need to learn from whatever it is that you're going through yeah it may be this seem rough and it's like you just ain't gonna make it and you probably wish you just roll over and die right now and all of that but no you don't no you don't we just don't like to go through nothing that's all that is we human and, and first and the first time we can cop out we gonna try okay so we human but just go through it honey listen the storm is not gonna last forever it's it's gonna end it's gonna end but at the end of the day when it's over i promise you you're gonna be like thank you lord i went through it i learned listen pay attention y'all just pay attention and listen to him. Listen to him. Pay attention to his signs, his warnings. There's always warning before destruction. It may seem like you're going through that destruction right now, but you're not. You're not going through the destruction, y'all. It's just it's just a little rough for you. Because he, he might have been trying to tell you and warn you in another way, in a simpler way. You saw it. 
But you decide you want to do what you want to do. And guess what? That's our father. You ain't none of his, okay? And you don't tell him what to do. And you don't do what you want to do, okay? So when he get tired of you being hard-headed, honey, he hit you where it hurt, okay? To wake you on up, to, 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 to get you to pay attention, to open them eyes on up one time for the one time. That's all that is, y'all. So don't be mad at him because he do things that he do for his reasons. And we don't have to understand why. Because if you was a parent... And you, and you tell your child something. You know what I'm saying? And you tell your child something. Do you want your child to come back to you and be like, I, I want to know why you told me. First thing you probably do, honey, is make them a part of that wall. Okay? So, the same thing with him. You can't, you can't, honey, what you thought this was? Or what you thought it is? Which one it was? Okay? Don't 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 do him. Okay? He going he going to always provide and he going to always take he going to always take care of you and he going to always be on your side. I'm telling you because when you start feeling them little lighter days, honey, that's when he start letting up on you, okay? That's all that is. He he going to be letting up on you when you start feeling like that storm is finna be over. That's him. That's his mercy. That's his grace on you. That's his love. He be like, okay, she learning now or he learning now. So I'm going on and let up on him a little bit. But if you start getting out of line and acting like you forgot, okay. If you get out of line and act like you forgot, okay, you best know. Guess what? If you think it was hard this time, you better know it just might be a little harder the next time. You want to know why? Because you being hard-headed. Don't nobody like no disobedient child, okay? And he and, and so he going to chastise you. That's what he do. He chastise you, okay? I ain't here to preach to you, but I'm here to tell you about the goodness of the Lord. And today is Sunday. You better let me, okay? You better let me, cause he probably was like, I ain't come here with nothing, with nothing, uh, scripted to say and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? I don't come here to try to preach to nobody, cause I know I don't know the Bible front to back and back to front and, and, and probably half of it. But I know what I know. I know what I know, and I know that God is our Father, and I know that God chastises us, and He does it to teach us stuff. He don't do it to hurt us. God would never do anything to hurt us, y'all. Never. Okay? Regardless of how you want to look at it. But he'll never do nothing to hurt us. So, why would you want to even believe any of that? Okay? Sorry, right, y'all. So, I'm going to wash my board off real quick. So, we're going to say amen to that good word right there. Cause I thank the Lord for giving me those words to say. Cause like I told y'all, I didn't I didn't come on here with something already planned to say. Is that music too loud, y'all? Please let me know. <clears throat> I got music in here. Hey, Sandy. Lisa, is the music loud, y'all? Let me know real quick so I can see. Can y'all even hear? Y'all probably don't even hear it. You don't hear no music. Okay, I got some little music for y'all. Hold on. It's right here behind you, so that's why I had to check. It's just a little instrumental, that's all. Let me turn y'all this way. <clears throat> okay, so over here, I got my kale. Like I said, we're soaking in the sink. And I got my potatoes, and I'm just rinsing them off real good. That's all I'm doing over here, y'all. Thank y'all for ringing the doorbell. I appreciate y'all for ringing the doorbell. We got I, I think I done meant to say it about two, three times, y'all, and still ain't said it. I'm going to go ahead on a set me a goal of 100. Y'all, if y'all don't mind 100 doorbell rings, please, y'all, um, if you one of the ones that did not ring the doorbell, please ring the doorbell for your girl one time for the one time. 
if you don't mind, please share my video, y'all. Please share it so I can get out there to other people so they'll know where y'all at, spending y'all time and learning how to cook a good soup. If you don't mind, share me on your Facebook, your Twitter, your Instagram, your Snapchat, your, your meet and greet, your Christian Mingle, your Facebook, your... Put me on everything. You can put me on your bimbo, whatever they call them, that mess. Put me on there, honey. Your bimbo, I think that's what it's called. Put me on there, y'all, okay? Y'all, share me. Don't, don't be stingy with me. How you want to know how you share? You got to hit that little, you got to exit out real quick. And you'll see where it say, I think it'll actually say share. Or you'll see something that look like this with two little circles on the end. Hit that right there. And that's how you share it. If you don't mind sharing my video for your girl one more time. Hey! Y'all better. Alright. So we got the potatoes nice and washed up. Okay, so now I got my, my my greens over here, my kale, and and I'm about to just give it a good rinse, and I'm gonna tear them just a little bit. They already in small pieces like they need to be, but just in case there is a piece that ain't in a small piece, this is what we're gonna do. We're just gonna do it like this. And break them up and and if you see a stem get that out of there you don't want the stems in the soup but if, if you sometimes you just can't help it okay a stem is not gonna hurt them so that's what we're gonna do to this right here y'all I got time for all that cutting, honey. This, this was already, our work was already cut out for us. So we try to, you know, skip, skip some steps for the king. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to be in there just working your whole little self to death, child. Okay, honey. You want to eat, but yeah, dang. Thanksgiving is over. Okay. You done did all that work on Thanksgiving, honey. Ain't you tired? Okay, then. So you better cheat where you can. You don't want no itty bitty pieces now, but you you know what I'm saying? You want when it's cooked down, you want it in nice sizes. You don't want it in no long strips is what I'm saying. Alright, so now that's gonna sit right here. And I'm about to get my uh strainer bone. My colander. I be forgetting that's what it's called, y'all, huh? All right, and then I'm just going to take these here, and we're just going to put them in here so they can be draining the extra water off of them. But make sure y'all do this step and wash them now, because, honey, these things might have some green on them. You be talking about something. <laughs> I don't know. What's wrong with my soup, man? I think my salt was old. No, your salt wasn't old. You ain't put no dog. You ain't wash it. You ain't wash that, that grit off of there, the dirt. <clears throat> so, y'all, make sure y'all wash the, uh, these, this kale. Anything, tell you the truth. Okay. All right, so we getting this up. Yeah. Okay, we at sixty-six, y'all. Can we get sixty-seven? Can I get a sixty-seven, y'all? I'm trying to get to a hundred. Y'all gonna help me get down? 
I'm quite sure everybody in here probably don't wrong the doorbell. I thank y'all for ringing it though. But we gonna get there. Y'all watch and see. We gonna get them. We gonna get to that hundred in no time. So next we're about to get us an onion cutter. Uh, excuse me. Oh yeah, y'all. Y'all knew I burp a lot, so y'all <laughs> excuse me. Okay, honey. I, like I tell my family members on here, they know. If I uh would you rather me a, a burp ain't number gas that your ass won't pass, honey. So do you rather me fall the burp? You take your pick. Okay. Honey, cause it's got to come out one way or another. You think I'm finna be sitting over here about to choke the bell cause I got a fart, a, a burp, honey. <laughs> okay. Don't, don't, don't do me. Don't act like y'all don't burp and fart and all kind of stuff like that now. I'm trying to be nice. But honey, it just come out when it won't. I burp so much, child. I just don't be knowing when I be burping. It just come up. Okay, so just excuse me. Okay, I'm just going on tell you now. Excuse me. All right. Hold on. I can't see you. All right, y'all. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm just whipping y'all around, honey. Okay, so now we're going to get us... You can do you one onion. It's your preference. I'm going to do just one because I don't want no onion meat flavor soup. I just want the onion for the flavor, not, you know, to take over the soup. All right, so now we finna get this onion cut up. So how we gonna cut the, let me get my pot going. I'm finna get me, what we gonna do, we gonna boil these potatoes by itself, y'all. All right, Okay, so we gonna get these potatoes. Boiled up by themselves. That way, when we get ready to throw this whole soup together, baby, it's not gonna take us a long time, huh, baby? <clears throat> I want to show y'all how to make this soup the quickest way I can. Okay, so all right. So now we're just gonna get this onion. Cut up. I want to say welcome to everybody that is new. I'm not going to see you. <clears throat> not and, and be able to talk to you. And answer all your questions and all that stuff like that. So just listen to me y'all. I'm not ignoring nobody because if you know me. We're going to dice this onion. Because if you know me, then you know that I do not let anyone on my channel go unnoticed. I don't care how many people is on my channel. If I can see you on the day that we is talking and the day I can see you and talk with you and welcome you and stuff like that, listen, you won't get welcome to my family, my, my family over here. If you don't. Only reason is, is because, hold on y'all, I got my hot water that's going on to get it started. And then I'm just going to take these potatoes and I'm going to put them 
down in this pot. And we're going to get them over here on the stove with a little salt in it because we want to season up these potatoes. Get it going. You know, the star on the seasoning going. And stuff like that. And, yeah, we're just going to let these here do what they do on their own. Okay, we ain't got to babysit them, but don't overcook them. You ain't trying to overcook them. You just want to get them to 410, and I just got enough water to cover them up. So, now, we're going to get this here onion diced up. If you don't want to dice it, then it don't matter. Listen, it's going to cook down anyway. It's just that so you can't see it. That's all this is for. But by the time this soup comes together, honey, you about to probably die ain't going to see it. No matter how you cut it up. You know what I'm saying? Unless you just decide to cut them up real big. You know what I'm saying? But... Yeah, this is how you want it right here. And one medium onion is good enough. Unless you just love onion like that. And you just use what you want to use, honey. I got onion popping everywhere. Okay, so. So now we're just going to get this onion here, right here. Put it in the bowl. All right. So now we got that. All right, so now we about to take it on over here to the stove, but I'm about to transfer y'all on over because y'all know, like I say, I like you in, in the pot, in the pot, you better get in the pot, hey, hey, in the pot, okay? All right, y'all, so we're going to get over here. Hold on, family. Close your eyes because I don't want to give you no, no whiplash or nothing. Okay. Hold up, sugars. Ooh, ain't you in there, girl? Guys, ain't y'all in there? Okay, you better know your sugar who gonna get you in there, in there, honey. I don't come to play. I don't come to play, baby. I want y'all to get this here. I want y'all to see textures and everything. All right. So now, this is my pot. It's hot. And so, what I'm about to do is... To start it off, I'm about to get me just a little bit of tad bit of oil, just a little bit in there, cause I need something. I need something to get these onions done. So we're gonna get these onions down in this pot. Child, we sizzling. We is cooking, baby, nice top. Okay, we is cooking, cooking, honey. All right, so you're going to get that going just like that, right there, like that, right there, honey, sugar, boo boo. Okay, so why are you getting the onions going, baby? I forgot to get my lid back there to get them potatoes boiling. So you're going to take your sausage. This is a mild Italian sausage, y'all. You can use hot. It's up to you what you want to do, okay? But when you do it, when you use your sausage... Make sure that you pull this little paper off the bottom and you'll be in here trying to cook paper, okay? All right. And we're just going to get that down enough. 
I got another pack. Listen, I love meat, okay? All right. So I don't want no little slim soup hunter, okay? So I, you know, two packs is really enough. But I'm just going, I'm just extra like that, y'all. You know what I'm saying? So don't charge it to me, okay? Don't charge it to me. But I'm just extra, y'all. I, 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 listen, okay? I, I like to eat and my family do too, honey. And if I want to cook them some, honey, I don't need them be looking at me like, where the meat at? Where the meat at? Okay. So, now I'm going to take this here roll of sausage. Only thing it's going to do is make it better, y'all, okay? So we're gonna take this roll of sausage and I'm gonna get that down in there as well. Like that. Right there, right there, like that. Right there. Put the ding on the dome and ring the doorbell. Put the ding on the dome and ring the doorbell. Put the ding on the dome and ring the doorbell. Put the ding on the dome and ring the doorbell. If y'all don't know. What the doorbell is, the doorbell is a thumbs up, the like button, you better hit it, hit it. One time for the, one time you better hit it, hit it. One time for the, one time. Bring that doorbell, y'all. Alright, so now we about to get us a little garlic off up in there. With this right here, you use about four to six cloves of garlic, or you just use about two tablespoons, heaping tablespoons. Of minced garlic just depends on you if you want to use it or not okay all right and so now we're just gonna get this here brown like cooked up we ain't trying to like crisp it or nothing like that we're basically only thing we really just trying to do is just get it cooked until it's done okay Alright, so I'm going to turn that back on up like that right there. And we're going to get this here worked, baby. Okay, and of, of course, this right here is going to produce oil and stuff like that. So if you want to drain yours, you can. But like I told y'all, and I tell y'all all the time, fat is flavor, baby. Okay, why y'all think I'm so flavorful? Why y'all think I'm so bubbly, honey, and just, just all everything that you need for yourself honey i'm full of flavor okay you better know a child you better if you didn't know well now you know all right all right so we're gonna let this right here go for a little second while we letting this go let's see what can i be doing oh i could be adding salt to these potatoes over here just to get them seasoned up and then we're gonna get us a lid on there hold on all right so that's gonna have to get the cooking all right so we about to get to working on this cheesecake. That's what we finna work on while this right here is trying to do what it need to do. We are gonna be working back and forth, y'all, okay? So, we finna get to going on this um this cheesecake, this sauce and all that stuff for the cheesecake and get the mixing up and all that good stuff. See, you just want all your little bits in here brown, okay? All right. So, let's see. Hold on, y'all. I'm 
get my dish water going on here real quick. Okay. Okay. Check this one more time. Oh, baby. All right, y'all. Hold on. Before this getting done, I'm finna throw my seasonings and stuff in here, y'all. And I know Italian sausage is seasoned, but listen, this is gonna be the seasoning for my um. Hold on, y'all. gonna be the seasoning for my um uh soup and stuff alright so I told y'all that I, you need chicken broth right so so my chicken broth sorry y'all if we go to buff friend y'all don't go nowhere only thing i need to do is hit one button good thing i did look because honey i wouldn't have known y'all was buffering back there child y'all had them just went flat straight out I ain't told me nothing Okay, so let's get the seasoning in here. Oh, and we're going to add the bacon, y'all. We're going to go and get the bacon off up in here. So when you go to Walmart, you're going to have about this much bacon in one little pack or a handful. All right, so that's how much bacon that y'all should put in there, okay, if, if you don't want to do like me. But I'm adding a little extra, okay? I'm using about that and half, okay? All right, because the more the better. All right, so now, let's start seasoning up. So now we're about to go in with us some. Hold on, family. All right, put your little onion powder in there. Okay. No, that was garlic powder. I'm just throwing me some complete seasoning in there. You can put this in there if you want to. Okay, that's optional, complete. And then I'm about to add some onion powder. Italian seasoning just a little bit and then I'll add the salt in a little while not right now
y'all, this smells so freaking delicious, y'all, already, honey. Hey, Mimi. Y'all see that? This is what you want. You just want it where it's brown, just like this. Just cook, not, not brown, but cook through. Okay? So, while we waiting on the potatoes, I have this down on low. And I don't want this to cook no more. We just waiting on the potatoes, okay? But when you do this right here, you de the pot that you, everything gonna be in, that's the pot that you want to cook the sausage in because you want all that flavor that's going to be in the bottom of this pot in your soup, okay? Just going to get that covered for right now. And buffering because it's, it's like it's buffering on my end and it's going to go out, but it ain't went out yet. Okay, so this is the chicken broth, y'all. And I'm going to need a little bit more to go with this, but my cup is already run up over. Okay. So. Yeah, it's going to be a big pot. All right, so we'll just get this here mixed up, dissolve that. Gonna work on this cheesecake, y'all. Welcome to anybody and everybody that's coming in, and everybody that is new. I want to give a special welcome to y'all because we love to welcome people to the family. Don't nobody over here go unnoticed, okay? So, please, if you would like to be welcome to the family, just let us know, y'all. And we will gladly, most definitely, welcome y'all. First thing we're going to work on the strawberries. You can use fresh strawberries, but baby, strawberries 
，好冷。Strawberries don't got a little hat. So we ain't gonna use the fresh ones. Okay, they fresh enough, freshly frozen. Okay, all right. So we're gonna get to working on these strawberries. And I'm going to use the whole bag. Your cream cheese, you want it to be sitting out so it won't be so hard for you to get it together. It's it's because it's, um, dang, I, uh, we got to improvise on, on something too, I think. Hold on. All right, so we're going to get these strawberries. And I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take them and I'm just going to, babe, you want to cut a small of half. Okay, so I'm just cut them up like that four times. Cut them small. You can cut yours in half or small. Sorry. Be like this. Sometimes we buffer and we just don't know why we be buffering, y'all. But it be YouTube, okay? It be YouTube. YouTube be over here trying to knock 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 your hustle for real. Like, why would you have your people over here that's trying to get it buffering? So, I y'all forgive me if we go to buffering, but only thing I have to do is hit a button and we'll be right back, okay? So what I'm doing is I'm cutting these strawberries up. Welcome to everybody that's coming in. I am Tiana, I'm going to be me. I'm happy to have you. Only thing I ask y'all to do is ring the doorbell one time for the one time for your girl. When I say ring the doorbell, that means hit the thumbs up, the like button, if you don't mind. And if you love my channel, then I ask that you become a sugar boo. How you become a sugar boo? You subscribe to my channel. And make sure you set that notification to bell to all so you'll be notified each and every time I upload a video. Hey, Camilla and Ava, if I didn't speak to you, I think I did, though. Okay, so finishing up these strawberries. So you just get it cut up into small pieces. And then we're gonna work on how we get them sweet and the filling. Soft as these is, you probably can just mash them, but you don't want all that juice because you don't want all that juice in your cheesecake. And when I do these, I like to make them individual and stuff, but I ain't gonna do that today. Yep, I like to make individual little cups, honey, because I ain't got the. It's I like I like how it preserves better when it's individual little cups. And then for to go on top, you can save you some nice little cute ones. But honey, we ain't got time for that today, okay? But it's gonna taste just as good, pretty or not. But y'all know I ain't gonna slop it together though. Y'all know I ain't gonna do that. All right, so I got my strawberries cut up. And now to sweeten them, this is what you're going to do. Okay, so you're going to take you some... Um, some powdered sugar. 
And the reason why I say take the powdered sugar is because you ain't going to have to worry about them little granules and stuff like that and wait on them to dissolve and all that stuff. So put you some powdered sugar on them. And then we're just going to get this here mixed up like that. And then if it needs to be a little bit sweeter, you can add just some sh regular sugar to it. But try to use the powder sugar as much as you can. Oh, baby, these a little bit more. These some delicious strawberries here already. So you're gonna get that done mixed up just like that and now here's the strawberries for your cheesecake so we're just gonna let that right down sit to the side and continue to get sweet all right so now Got to check these potatoes over here to make sure that they ain't trying to get away from me. Only thing you want these is fork tender. Okay. Woo! I'm gonna let them cook for about two more minutes and then they're gonna be ready. All right. So now we're gonna get our filling. What you gonna need to do Hold on, family. All right. So now what you're gonna need to do is take your uh, cream cheese and you wanna get this here. Try me in this butter knife, okay? Get this here open. And I'm gonna make mine in a pan like this, okay? And my favorite part of cheesecake, y'all, is the crust. Woo, baby. But guess what? I do my cheesecake different from everybody else, okay? So I'm going to show y'all what I do to make this good old delicious five cheesecake. Okay? So just going to get this here like that right there. This meal going to come together so fast. I'm finna go ahead on and preset my preheat my oven to 375 degrees, and that is gonna be for my garlic bread. Cause once these potatoes get in here, in this pot, this meal, this meal gonna be almost ready, almost done. All right. So now we're gonna take this cheese, cream cheese, y'all, some more fattening. Okay. If we gonna do it, we might as well just go ahead on and do it up. Okay. One time for the one time honey okay listen you better scrape all your uh cream cheese honey off of there y'all know you got to get them pennies honey they don't know how to come off pennies p-n-n-n-n -N -N. get them pennies off of there child okay look you don't scrape the dollars look they got them dollars right there so now this the pennies you got to get them off of there child okay honey you don't pay you pay for all this the box and the paper honey because if we could have used that up in here okay it probably would have went in there but all right so now we're gonna look at that all that right there you could have been missing child y'all know i don't like the waist honey all right so now we're gonna get this here 
And what we're gonna do is we're gonna get this here, just break it down just a little bit, like that right there. See, it's already soft. Just break that down. Then what you're gonna do is you wanna get this to a smooth consistency, right? So I'm just gonna go ahead and add me a little of this powdered sugar to it. See, this is a sweet and good feeling too. Don't add no regular granulated sugar, y'all, because you might not like it. Okay, I'm going to add a little cinnamon to mine because I like the cinnamon in it. Don't go crazy with it because you don't want the cinnamon to take over. But add you some cinnamon. Add you some... Uh, oh, I already got one open. Add you some... For them. Listen, y'all, don't, don't... Listen, you, this imitation, okay? If you want to use real... Um, uh, vanilla, you use real vanilla, but I'm showing y'all how to do this the delicious way with some cheap stuff, okay? You add as much as you want to add. I like the flavor of this vanilla, so I add a little bit more, okay? And it's not gonna make it too strong because it's not that, um, it's not that, that it's not the real stuff, okay? All right, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our beaters. And we're going to get it on our mixer, honey. This going to save your arm, your hands, and everything, okay? And we're going to get this here mixed up. Oh, shit. How are we going to mix something that ain't plugged up, honey? All right, so let's get it plugged up so we can get it mixed up. All right. So now... Move, y'all. All right, so now to, to break it down just a little tad bit more, I'm going to take a little bit of this heavy cream. Just a little bit. About a little tablespoon or two of it. All right, so now we got that smooth as we about gonna get it. So now we just gonna take our spatula. Just gonna get this hill, scrape down and around just like this. Taste that filling. Get some more sugar in them. You make this sweet as you like it. Then we're gonna take. I want me some more. Uh, I'm gonna put me some more of this vanilla in there, y'all. Just a little bit. And we're just going to take this here. And we're going to fold in our Cool Whip. Not whipped cream, but Cool Whip. Okay, so I'm going to get these potatoes, y'all, because I know they're done. And I'm finna scoop this, this whole container of this cool whip right in here. And we're gonna fold this here in and it's gonna fluff it up. It's not gonna make it taste like cool whip because you got your cream cheese in there and all that stuff like that. It just fluffs it up. Put air in it and give it a, 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 a real good taste, okay?
Mm. Yes, baby. That's good right now. Mm. All right. So now, we can let this sit right here for a second because we got more important thing to do. Okay? So, hold on one second. I'm gonna need y'all to get right back over here. Because we finna we finna get with this soup here, okay? We about to get with it. Hey y'all, 120. Uh-oh, five more people will be done reached our goal of a hundred doorbell rings. If you don't know what the doorbell is, I'm finna tell you and you hold up. You hold up, wait a minute, hold up, wait a minute, let me put my pimping in it, pimping, pimping in it, okay, yes, honey, I be, I be pimping these pots, you hear me, I be pimping them, hold on, family, okay. All right, so these potatoes should be done. Is done. Potatoes should be in it. They is done. So now we got our soup right here, the meat. Okay. So. Hold on. Ooh, this smells so good, y'all. So now this is what we finna do. We're gonna take our potatoes and we're just gonna add that right on in there. It's gonna break down, y'all. We're gonna take our chicken broth. Pour that in there. And a little bit more. You're gonna use about a whole box of chicken broth when you do it, y'all. Okay? So I'm adding that in there like that. Then I'm adding all my you see that's why I didn't add no salt because the chicken broth it already got salt. So I, I want to be in control of my salt, y'all. Okay. Alright, so we're gonna put the potatoes in here. See how that skin is? That's what you want like that, child. Be all through your soup and stuff. You know what I'm saying? Little pieces of skin. Honey, good. Good, baby. I'm about to show you something. All right. So we got that in there. Like that. And then if you need a little bit more liquid or something like that, we're going to use the liquid from the potatoes because it's already got that little flavor and stuff seasoning and all that to it okay so now we're just gonna toss this in here it's gonna tear yes you don't want all your potatoes to stay like that nope you don't but you do want to have you some pieces in there you know what i'm saying all right now i know this was this soup is looking water-based right brothy okay this is how it is when you get it from them Y'all, you don't never really see no whole pieces of potatoes in it, okay? You don't. But when it's your stuff, guess what? <laughs> can somebody tell them, just in case they don't know? You can do what you want to do, because it's yours, okay? Don't let nobody tell you how to do your stuff in the kitchen, because in the end, can somebody tell them what I love to say? In the end, what? As long as it what? Oh, okay. Tastes good. Oh, yeah. It, that's all that matters. Okay. And you see, I'm breaking some of mine up. But don't break them all up because this is still hot. It's going to still break down. Okay. So don't break them all up. Leave you some pieces in there like that. All right. Now, 
when you add your heavy cream to this, y'all, what you want is for your for it not to be boiling because you don't want your cream to curd on you. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this nice kale that we already washed and broke down into little pieces and it's gonna look like a lot but it's gonna cook down to nothing and we're gonna add that right on in here like so okay and we're gonna add like i said when you need some more juice some more water you're gonna add it from the potato stock But yeah, y'all, this here gonna cook down. If you don't like kale and you wanna use spinach, use spinach. Ain't nobody trying to tell you what to do. But like greens, what we're finna do is we're gonna let this wilt down and we'll, we'll come back and add the rest. So I'm gonna turn my eye back up a little bit and we're gonna let these wilt, wilt down and I'm gonna add the rest. So, to do that, I'm gonna put my lid on now, like that, and let it do what it do. All right, so now we gotta get back to this. Uh, we gotta get back to this here, 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 um, cheesecake. Hold on, family. Working with limited space, y'all. So now we got this. Now what we about to do is make make our um our um crust for the for the um for the um cheesecake. And I like a lot of crust, y'all. And especially with this big pan I'm finna make, we most definitely finna have a lot of crust. I love the crust, y'all. Alright, so you're going to need you some graham crackers and butter for this part. Margarine, if that's what you want. Honey, don't nobody kill. I use margarine. So if anybody tell y'all, I ain't even how to use no margarine. You pass it, yeah, but you pass that. And you, child, you better tell them they better buy it, okay? That's what you do. Tell them to buy it. And then see if they got any more suggestions, okay? All right, so we're just gonna take us some of this butter here, margarine, and I'm gonna melt a lot of it down because I don't know how much I'm gonna need, so I'm gonna melt that much. While we melting the butter, we finna get the crust going. All right, so in my bowl, what we're going to do is we're going to take the graham crackers. You could most definitely, I done did it like this. I done took my graham crackers and I done put them in a bag and crushed them up like so in the bag, okay? Just like that. And you could do all your graham crackers just like that, y'all. Just crush them up. All right. So like I said, I'm making a lot of crust. I don't know how much, but I'm making a lot. So that was like a pack and with only two of them missing. Hold on, family. All right, so I'm just 
finna get the rest of this kale over here in the pot, y'all. That's all I'm doing, okay? I ain't doing nothing behind your back. I'm just putting the kale over here in the pot so everything can get cooked down at the same time. All right? Okay. So now. We about to get this other pack broke down. I'm gonna do one more pack because I'm making a big pan of it, y'all. So I'm gonna do one more pack. All right. Crunch them up. Break them down. Like so. And I got the cinnamon ones, y'all. Because I wanted that extra flavor. You can use the honey. I don't use the honey ones before. You can use that if you want to. Okay. So now we got them pretty much broke down. The butter's going to help us the rest of the way. Melting that some more. All right, so while I'm melting that, while I'm melting that, honey, y'all think y'all finna get away from me? And these dishes, <laughs> these dishes ain't been washed, baby, honey. Let's pause for the calls, honey, and get the dishes together, y'all. This is a cooking blog, not a cooking show. For those of you that don't know, okay? So when you do cooking blogs. Everything you do in your kitchen, I do in mine, and y'all get to see it. So this part right here is for the ones that like to watch the cleaning and washing dishes videos and stuff like that. I love them. I don't know about y'all, but I love them. All right. I hope y'all is enjoying y'all self over here. I'm enjoying y'all. I'm, I'm, I'm happy to be showing y'all this good meal that I'm making on this Sunday. Especially on this cold Sunday, y'all. Okay. All right, but I know you're ready. You just hold on. Don't be rushing me. All right, so get these still washed up real quick. Y'all, delete that comment for me if you don't mind. time for no mess. I know I do. But if you can't get it, it's alright. Because honey, what, what we don't do, we don't see no haters, okay? Ain't nobody got time for the haters. Ain't nobody got time for the haters. Ain't nobody got time for the haters. Ain't nobody got time. That's why I said ain't got time for them. I don't care if I, I don't care if I'm not there for them. I'm just saying I ain't got time for them. Ain't nobody got time for you. Okay. All right. We don't pay no haters, no attention, baby. I told y'all, y'all come over here hating, but you gonna come back again a family member. I'm telling you. You are already a family member. You just don't know it, though. You know what I'm saying? We welcome you, honey. We ain't trying to run you off. You run yourself off. But ain't nobody got time for the haters. Ain't nobody got time for them. Okay. So, yeah, y'all. Don't be paying them no attention. Let them come in here and say what they want to say. And when I see them, I'll give them a But, honey, if I don't, honey, it is what it is. Because we ain't paying them no attention. You want to know why? Because we got them hater blockers on, okay? So when you got the hater blockers on, them, put them up. Put them up, y'all. Put the hater blockers on so you don't let everybody else know that's probably feeling aggravated by, by them. Show them what we do over here, y'all. 
show them what we do. We got a song for them. I just sung it for you. We got a song for them because that's our family members, y'all. That's them family members that you don't want around, but they come anyway. But they is welcome, though. You know what I'm saying? They welcome. Because, honey, I'm telling you, by the time I'm through with them, oh, they going to know how to act, okay? Won't, they going to know. They just ain't know, but they going to know. They going to learn today. All right. So the Zupa soup is over here boiling away, y'all. Let me show y'all the Zupa. I'm going to just put you up right here because we ain't done. So watch from right here. Oh, baby. Oh, I need you. Okay. Let me get y'all over here. Real quick, like, then we'll get back to the cheesecake in just a second. Y'all see that? All right, so we're gonna turn this down here on low, right here. Y'all see that? Mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna taste it for seasoning in a minute. Y'all see that? That's how you want this soup to look, just like this. Y'all see that? Ooh, that looks so good, honey. All right, so now we don't have a bowl. I'm gonna taste this real quick. Just the broth of it. Cause whatever the broth tastes like, that's what the rest of it gonna taste like. So get your broth perfect. Season just right to your taste. And I, I, I might decide if I'm gonna add some little red pepper flakes to it or not. Oh, baby, baby. Baby, this soup is good. Mm. Y'all see how that meat just stretched out through the soup? See, y'all probably thought I had too much, didn't you? Honey, that, you see meat in every bite. Okay, honey, I ain't come to play. All right, so now we got it like this, y'all. <coughs> <coughs> I'm coming, Michael. So now... You're going to take this heavy cream, baby. And you just going to pour that cream. And now this is how you make it the creamy soup. Y'all see that? Baby. Baby. Baby, this soup is good. Hold up. Did we? Oh, baby. And we done made it. Hold on, y'all. And I'm over here singing the song. <laughs> I must a new child. Okay, so now we're just going to let this here simmerize. Okay? For about a good 20, 30 minutes. And that's done. Okay? So we're going to get that another little taste with the cream in it okay you want some 
Here you go. Taste it and let me know what you. You see that broth? Ooh, baby. Mm mm mm. Mm. Ooh. But we ain't gonna be wasteful, baby. Let's just go and pour the rest of that in there, okay? All right. Honey, ain't now one of them for 10 cooks, honey. Go and throw it in there when I get off camera, baby. Uh-uh. You, <clears throat> you gonna get what it is right now. Okay? All right. But, y'all, this is so delicious. Mm-mm-mm. You can taste that bacon flavor. You can taste the Italian sausage. <clears throat> it don't need no more salt. Y'all, this here is bussin', bussin'. Bussin', bussin'. Look at this. Look at this here. Just the right amount. Ooh! So, <clears throat> now what I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna pour just a splash of that right there in there. To stretch it on out even more, y'all. Okay? Yes, baby. So, now I got me a whole stock pot of soup. And this is going to be good to throw in the freezer and freeze it up, honey. Okay. You best know it is. All right. So, now we're just going to put this on medium or something like that. And we're just going to let this just, you know, simmerize for about another 20, 35, 20, 30 minutes. Not 35. It don't take that long. Just a few minutes. You just want to get everything time enough to just come together. Okay. Hey, Nirvana. Oh, excuse me. Okay, so now. I see a tater in this pot. Okay. I know some of y'all love that soup <clears throat> from Oligar, but y'all be like, who? I ain't finna go spend no regular price. I'm gonna wait till they have that soup and on, on, on lunch for a special or something like that, or soup and salad day or something. And then next thing you know, you be done forgot, and then you ain't get you none, and now you mad. Okay, so now I done showed y'all how to make this soup here and stuff. And it's gonna taste just like it. Like I said, you can add some red pepper to it if you wanna make it spicy. If you don't, eat it just like it is. But I think I might just add my little, a little bit on the side cause I don't wanna mess around and uh, add too much. And then I can't eat it and they can't eat it cause I don't like nothing spicy. I just like little hints here and there. You know what I'm saying? All right, so hold on sugar. But since I know y'all <laughs> gonna leave me, hold on, because we gotta finish these dishes, okay? What you thought this was? What you, what you thought it was or what you thought it was? Or which one? Did you think? Okay. All right, so hold on, family. Oh, one last thing I forgot to do, y'all. Hold on. I forgot one little step. I'm going to take a little water. And a little cornstarch. Like this. Make you a little slurry. Just a little bit. And this is what, and you pour this over in the soup, right? While it's simmerizing. And this is what's going to help it have that creamier flavor. You don't want it thick, though. You still want it runny. But this right here is going to make it taste creamier, okay?
no science to it, y'all. At all. Just it, once you get the going on it and you and, and you get the taste in it, just go from what you what you what you want it to look like, what you want it to taste like. Cause you don't have to use the whole bag of kale like I did. But I did because I want that extra kale in mine. You know what I'm saying? So you <clears throat> You add as much as you want to add, okay? Now let me get this bone back out this trash real quick, child. Okay, because I need to use this just in case I need some more broth. I'm going to put some of this broth right here in this bone. So just in case I need it, I have it. Potato don't fell out of there. Those of you that know me, y'all know I don't like to waste nothing, child. Okay, that right there just hurt my feelings. That piece of potato just fell in there. Girl, I could use that piece of potato. Oh shit, hold on, I almost forgot. Hold on, family. We're gonna get done eventually today, okay? <clears throat> I wanna thank y'all for helping me get to those 100 doorbell rings. If you don't know what the doorbell is, the doorbell is the thumbs up, the like button. Please hit it one time for the one time for your girl. If you don't mind, okay? I appreciate you. We made it. We made it. We made it to a hundred. Do, do. Oh, we made it. Do, we made it. Do, we made it to a hundred. Do, do. Oh, we made it. Do, we made it. Do, we made it to a hundred. Do, do. Oh, we made it. Do, we made it. Do. We made it to a hundred and twenty-three. Thank y'all. What's up, big baby? We made it. We made it. We made it to a hundred. Do, do. Uh, we made it. Do, we made it. Do, we made it to a hundred. Do, do. Uh, we made it. Do, we made it. Do. We made it to a hundred. Do, do. Oh, we made it. Do, we made it. Do, we made it to a hundred and twenty-three. <laughs> Thank y'all. Thank y'all. Hey, Eric. Whew. No soliciting yourself over here on my channel if y'all don't mind. Okay. This ain't the channel for that. Thank you. All right, so, whew. okay, let's finish these dishes. Oh.
All right, so hold on. All right, I'm putting my pot on the simmer, y'all. I put the pot, on, pot, pot down on low so that it can start You know, it's, it's really done. So I'm just putting it down on low now. And it's really just going to finish simmering together. And that's it. All right. So now, y'all ready to get back to go over here to this? what this look like in a minute so hold up I tell y'all, listen, y'all got to try the soup, okay? If y'all try, please let me know what you think about my soup, okay? All right. So now we're going to take this butter and we're just going to drizzle a little at a time over these, over these um, uh, graham crackers. And you're going to take your hands and you're going to get it all mixed together. And you want to add butter until... All of it come together and it forms and it stick together and stuff like that. A little bit. Not too much. You don't want it too wet. But you do. Okay. Hold up. Not too wet. You still want it to be in a way kind of dry. Yep. Like this. Just like this right here. Yep. You see how it's starting to come together? You see that? You want it to be able to hold together in a way like that, but you don't want it too, too wet. You still want a little dryness to it. Okay. So now I'm just gathering all these little crumbs and make sure I get them all in here good. And I'm going to give this a little taste. Mm. 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 Yes, boo boo. All right. So this is how you want it to look. It's crumbly, but it's not too wet. You see it? That's how you want it. All right. So now, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your pan. You're gonna your pan. Okay. We're gonna spray this pan just a little bit with a little spray, a little oil, or grease it, or whatever. All the way around, just a little bit. Just like that. 
Okay. Don't don't try to be specific. All right, so now you're going to take some of your crust and you're going to put it right down here in the bottom. And I'm going to need some more. I can already tell. I'm going to need me some more. And then you're going to take this and you're going to mash it down like that, right there, like here. And yes, I'm going to store it in this aluminum pan. But if you don't want to use aluminum, then you can use something cute or you can make individual ones like I like to make. I love to make them individual. Okay, so now what I'm about to do is I'm going to take some of my filling. And then we're just going to smooth it out. Try not to get your crumbs mixed in. But if you do, honey, it don't matter. It's going to get eight. It's just for the presentation, that's all. Okay? Just like that. Y'all, yeah, for those of you that know, when I had made this back a while ago, honey, I promise you, this was like one of my little signature desserts because I love it because it's not too sweet. I can't stand sweet stuff. Uh -uh. I'm not a sweet eater, y'all, for real, for real. But I can eat this, especially homemade. Because sometimes to me, I, I, to tell you the truth, I don't even like cheesecake for real, for real. But I love this, okay? I don't like cheesecake. Ch cheesecake too sweet for me. Uh, like I said, I'm not a sweet eater. Okay, so now what we're going to do is, maybe we're just going to do, we're just going to do this one layer, I think. Because let me tell y'all. I'm one of the ones I like to layer mine, but it look like I ain't going to have no strawberry. So I'm going to use my hands. I don't know what y'all going to do, but I'm going to use mine because I'm going to strain this juice. And we're going to take these strawberries. And you can make this your last layer, only one layer, if you want to. But I love mine's layer. It's mine's, and I can do what I want to do. So that's what I like to do. Okay? And honey, normally it'll have a little bit more than that, but I want to do another layer because I'm extra. All right, so that's one layer. Now we're going to take our crumbs and we're going to make us some more crumbs. I think I have, yeah, I got some more. And I'm going to make me some more crumbs. And I, I, I turned it down. Okay, and then we're going to take these. And now we're not going to worry about pressing them in. We're just going to crumble them. Let's just make this one layer, y'all. We're going to make it one layer. Okay. Yep, we're just going to do one layer. But if you had enough strawberries, then you're going to do more than one layer. Okay. And then that's what makes it Tiana. Tiana's homemade strawberry cheesecake. Okay. No bake. So that right there is what you got. And then we're going to take the rest of this and we're going to put it right here on top. And that filling right there can go in the refrigerator because that'll be good for some more another time. Okay? All right. I don't know if you can freeze it now. But I hope they eat this up fast so I can make some more and um, get rid of that filling. I should have bought two bags of strawberries, but I didn't. So, this is my cheesecake, y'all. Just like this. Right here. Y'all see that? Ain't it pretty? With the strawberries peeking through. You got crust on the bottom and crust on the top. I do mine like this, y'all, because I love crust, okay? All right, so now, put some on top. I was gonna put some, who you talking to, me? Okay. 
You talking about the feeling? Yeah, Brenda. I'm sitting over here thanking Brenda. <laughs> Brenda, I was thinking about putting some more on the top and make some more crust. That sounds good, don't it? I think that's what I'm going to do. That's what I had thought of. I think I'm going to make some more crust. Yep, that's what I think I'm going to do. And then I can use it up. I was, You know me, girl. I don't like to waste nothing. And I know this right here, this meal and this dessert is fattening enough, honey. And so I was like, I need to just go ahead on and just use this up. So I was thinking that, but thank you for saying it because now you're about to make me do it. Okay, so let before I do that, let's get this garlic bread going. The oven I've been on long enough. I'm not gonna make my homemade garlic butter today because I got me some spread in the refrigerator that I needed to use up. Ooh, baby, I just thought about something. I'll, 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 I'll get some Okay, so what was I finna do? Oh, my bread. Hold up. All right, so I got me some bread, y'all. It was on sale, and I purchased this uh, French loaf bread with garlic and herb, and it was on sale for 60, 60 cent, 69 cent. So I'm gonna use this right here. And make us some garlic bread. So, what I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna cut pieces like this on. How many pieces of garlic bread you want, babe? One or two? What? No, for real. How many pieces you want? Babe, you gonna eat some uh, cold garlic bread? Okay. All right. So then I just say the rest of this right here. And I'm gonna put it in the refrigerator to make sure it don't go bad, okay? All right, so now. Perfect, y'all. So now we're just gonna take this garlic butter spread and we're gonna get this hill on our bread. Like that. And we're gonna get this in the oven and let this hill toast up.
You can make breadsticks if you want to, but I'm doing garlic bread. More flavor, more flavor. That's all. Should have let this set out for a little bit so I could spread better. But it's all right. Spread that little bit right down this side. Just like that. All right, so now what I'm about to do is, which I should have did it first. So now we're about to get this in the oven. And just toast it up. I'm coming, family. All right, so we're going to get the rest out. Um, another little bit of um, graham crackers. And we're about to get them on in here. And we're going to make some more crust. Ooh, y'all, it's going to be good now for real. I 
love the trust. Um, who is that? You being hard headed, so you got to go. You want three pieces? I got you. All right, let's see what this hill is going to be like. Okay, so that's good right there to me. All right, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the rest of this here and we're gonna put it right on top of here. You want to be able to spread it easy, y'all? Just get your fork. Gonna be so good. sit that right here on the side honey cuz this is what we gonna use to get a little taste okay all right so now I'm about to take these hill crumbs and just put them on top you can put some more strawberries is what I would recommend put some more strawberries and then put you put these on top And this is how you make Tiana's No Bake Strawberry Layer Cheesecake. And it tastes even better as it sits. That's my cheesecake, y'all.
I wish y'all could see the layers, but I didn't do it in the bowl this time so you could see the layers and stuff. But when you do it like this and you put it in a glass bowl, that bowl that I used to mix the filling up in the first time, you'll see all the layers. All right, so we're gonna get us a little taste child on this side. Oh, this is a big old taste, ain't it? Here y'all go. Mm-mm. Y'all know we got to taste it together. Tastes good, crap! I did that. Ooh, baby. Y'all look at that. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. That's good, y'all. Mm -hmm. So now, I'm just gonna um, cover it up. I'm gonna take me a piece of this parchment paper. And then, spray it. And just lay it right there on top so your so your stuff don't stick to it. And then take your piece of foil. And put it on top of that. And bam, boom, bam, thank you, ma'am. I y'all appreciate it. Y'all welcome. Y'all welcome. And I just put this in the refrigerator and it's ready to go. All right. So now we got that. We got all that extra butter right there, honey. I might just try <laughs> throw it away. <laughs> throw it away, Tion. All right, I throw it away. I was gonna put it back in the fridge for the child, let it get back hard and scrape it back in my bowl, honey. Tell the truth, shame the devil, but I was child. Okay, I was.
So we just waiting on the bread now, y'all. Which is almost done. All right, 
Now to the soup. Y'all ready? You ready? Voila! Voila! Y'all look at this soup. I don't need no more liquid. It's loose enough. So. Y'all look at that. With those potatoes through there, you see it? You see that? Oh, y'all look how delicious that look. Now you don't need nothing else with this cause you got your meat, you got your potatoes and you got your vegetable. And then you got an extra starch on the side, which is the bread. Then you got even more calories, honey, with the dessert. So now, you just get your, uh-oh. You just get your song in your bowl. Honey, yes. And this is the soup, y'all. So we're gonna get that on a nice plate. Y'all really, I'm just doing this for y'all because honey, my family, they be like, put that in the bowl. Ain't nobody got time to be washing no dishes. But I'm doing this for y'all. Hey. Huh? No, not Huh? Come here, babe. Well, come here and tell them what kind it tastes like. It might taste like mine. And here go the garlic bread, y'all. Come here, babe. Well, pause the game. Put your garlic bread on there like that. Then you're gonna take that Parmesan cheese. You can use regular. You ain't gotta be all fancy. I just was, I told y'all I'm extra. So I wanted to be like Gar Olive Garden when they come and they be shaving that cheese on your, uh, on your soup. That's why I did, that's why I bought the good one because I wanted to shave for y'all. Shave it on y'all. Okay, so I'm gonna get some right here. And I'm going to shave it. Hold on, make sure I got this turned around to the right side. Okay. And I'm just going to shave some of this here. It's good cheese. Maybe you want to shave a little bit, honey. So when you do this at home, you can shave as much as you want. Okay. Okay. I want to say 
If y'all is here and you is new, welcome to my channel. I'm happy to have y'all. But let me go ahead on and introduce y'all to a few channels, if you don't mind. First off, I want y'all to go and show my sister channel some love. Her name is Styled X Nikita, S T Y L E D. The letter X, Nikita, make sure everything is lowercase. And what she do is she's the one that does my dreads. She is doing other stuff on her channel as well. So I ask that y'all go and show her channel some love. I also ask that y'all go and show my sister-in-law channel some love. Her channel name is Life of the Wave Family. And she do um, different stuff on her channel too, y'all. So, y'all go show, show her channel some love. And also, I ask that y'all go over and show Soulful Tea channel some love. Soulful Tea is another cook, y'all. And y'all go over and show her channel some love, y'all, if y'all don't mind. And when y'all get over this parsley, I'm putting on that. Y'all know Miss Parsley got to come to every food fairy. Really. So, um... When not when y'all get over on her channel, I on their channels I ask that y'all let them know that y'all came from Tiana. I can only be me. I sent y'all okay. So once again, those channels is Style X Nikita, Life of the Wave Family, and Sofa T. S O U L F U L T. All right, y'all. Some of y'all probably already know who she is. So if you came over from her channel, then I thank y'all for coming. Bang. Baby, 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 hey, Miss Shirley, you about to tell them if you don't mind, one game that's a dope bell for you, girl, babe, one more time, hey, if you don't mind, one game the a dope for you, girl, one more time, one more time. If you don't mind, one game the doorbell for you, girl. One more time, it's not spinach. Whoa. That is not spinach. It's lo yeah. ruffle leaf cabbage. That shit don't look like no. You be lying. I that said ruffle like... leaf. Ain't no spinach in there, huh? Man, I don't know if I want. Come on, to taste. taste. No, I want you to taste this here. Why you put it in too many bowls? What I told y'all. Don't worry about all that. God dang it. Man, why you got so much green shit in here? You, if you don't taste my damn... I'm healthy already. You know what I do for a living? I'm healthy now. Oh, you already said it smelled good. So I don't know what you're smelling for. That's cheese on top. Taste it with the cheese too now. I'm tasting sausage. Kind of spicy. Got a little peak in it. Real spicy. It ain't spicy. Yeah, it's spicy. I'm glad we didn't get the hot then. Man, what's in, what's up with the green? God dang. It's good though, ain't it? I told you it's ruffle leaf cabbage. Dip your dip your um garlic bread in the juice and taste it. Hold on, let me see this bullshit right now. This that soup, my favorite soup from Olive Garden. Mm-hmm. It might be too much green. Man, my stuff gonna be fucked up. Well, you need the shit. You don't even want to eat too much green. Babe, come on now. Quit playing. You know you're eating the stuff. Y'all, this how my husband is. Don't pay his ass no attention. But he going to tell y'all the damn truth. One thing about it. He don't care nothing about hurting my feelings. You give it a 12. You give it a 12? You give it a 12. Mm-hmm. It's zero with the is spinach it in it. Is shit. it creamy? It's good. I got stones going on. You want to taste a little bite of the cheesecake for him? No, I don't want all that. Look, I'm, I'm pushing it now, y'all. I'm pushing it. I tried, though. I did try. All right. So, we got to get ours. Hold on. Let me let me uh fix grandma's on real quick. And then we got to taste, honey. Because one thing we do over here, honey, we get mouth distance apart. Okay, honey. So, I'm most definitely going to let y'all know. Honey, I'm shaving me some more cheese. I'm most definitely going to let y'all know what it tastes like, honey. You... What you thought this was? You ready? I know you is. Honey. With my plastic bowl. 
Oh, now y'all get a fucking plastic bowl. I ain't gonna Honey, that was the, the presentation bowl. You lucky to get that, because you normally don't. It don't matter. All right, so y'all got the plate for here. This another plate to go, and then y'all know y'all like the refill plate, right? Okay, so y'all about to get the refill one in just a second. Grandma don't eat cheese, y'all, so don't put no cheese on hers. I say, come on. Your food ready. Huh? Your food is ready. Oh, you done? Here we go. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I got to put the cheese on top of mine. There go grandma, y'all. Uh -huh. I was telling them, there you go. I was telling them, there you go. They looking at you. Oh, hey, y'all. They say, hey. I'm cleaning up my room. That's what she been in there doing, y'all. Cleaning her room. Sweeping the floor and stuff. Look like she was making up her bed, too. What you doing, making your bed? I'll be back in there, baby. All right, y'all, let's get mouth distance and get this here taste. Talking to me. Oh, oh they was talking to me. Hold on. Talk to y'all later. Grandma said she'll talk to y'all later. All right, y'all. So, my mouth distance. Grandma say Merry Christmas, y'all. Hey, Teresa.
Yeah, look at that. When I tell y'all this soup is so good, like I said, if you don't want to use the um kale, you can use the um you can use spinach if you want to. All right, so dear and the Father, thank you, Lord, for this food that we're about to receive. And I ask that there'll be minimal blessings stored upon us. And God, I ask that there's anyone in need of a meal. I ask that you bless them with one. In Jesus' name, Amen. All right, let's eat. So we're gonna get us. Y'all, I ain't finna burn my mouth up for y'all. Be don't burn my lip off. Oh, hey, Here y'all go. Y'all get the first. Oh, let me blow it off for you. I don't want to burn y'all mouth neither. It smells so good. It ain't even tasted yet, y'all. What's on Christmas menu, girl? Probably seafood. There y'all go. That first big bite. Mm-hmm. Look at the sausage right there. Yes. Mm. Bussin! Bussin! Just like it, y'all. Mm. Oh, baby. Ooh, ooh. There you go. Hold on, Grandma. Oh. Tell them what you think. Huh? I heard you say, mm. tell them what you think. Oh, the food good. Mm -hmm. What I was saying, mm. Mm -mm, I ain't took my sugar. Oh. <laughs> That's what I was talking about. Oh, yeah, you need to take your sugar first. But it's good? Mm-hmm. Okay, hold on. Let me go get your machine real quick. It's delicious. Hold on, y'all, real quick. Real quick, like, so Grandma can do this for her so she can taste this here for y'all. It's good. All right, you can eat one. Oh, you're good, honey. Okay, now taste it for them. So they can see you tasting it. I don't know what it is, but it's good. It's sausage, potato, and kale. It's called a Zupa soup. It's mm -hmm. one of my favorite soups when we go out to eat at Olive Garden or somewhere. Yeah. That's who sell it. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, he do. And the garlic bread, dump the garlic bread in the ju in the in the in the. In That's the what I do. Oh, you did. Mm -hmm. So Grandma says good, y'all. All right. Oh, hold up, hold up. Let me go back. Hold on, hold on, hold on, y'all. Hold on, hold on. We get another review. We get another review. Oh, no. <laughs> what you said now? I said I can't eat it all, but it's busting like a motherfucker, though. Man, you you enjoying that, ain't no? Yeah. I can make that again, ain't no? Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh. He said it's he's, he said it's good. Ain't no without it, y'all. Cause you really the 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 kale, it gives it a uh what's up uh uh grandma cooking? The kale gives it an extra some some. Okay. That's why I told you break the kale up because you want little pieces, but not too fine. Cause you wanna you wanna at least taste it. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 Yeah. Oh, the bread just fell in there like I knew what it was supposed to do. Mm. There y'all go. Mm. Mm-mm. -mm. Mm. Hold on, Grandma. Hold up. Mm. Yeah. Cha. Mm. Mm. One more time. Mm. Mm mm mm. One more. Mm mm mm. Mm. Y'all know. This busting. Mm mm mm. Girl, it's busting. And it's good. A different kind of soup. Get tired of chicken noodle soup and all that. Mm. Mm. So, we got to dig in. Hold on. I can't just make this and not dig into it for y'all. I got to dig into this. This cheesecake, if you wasn't here. Let's fix up some cheesecake. My cheesecake. No bake, layer, cheesecake. That's why it tastes good. Okay, y'all. So we finna. Y'all, I'm gonna have to just get it out of here. The best way. But y'all see that?
Y'all look at him. Oh, look. It's my layered cheesecake, y'all. You can make this, like I said, in individuals and stuff like that. But honey, listen, just because it's tore up don't mean it ain't going to be good, okay? So I'm going to let grandma taste this too. For y'all. And then I'm going to show y'all the layers in the pan. So fattening. It is. But it's not too sweet. That's what I like about my cheesecake. It's not too sweet. Y'all look at that. That's why I say you don't want all that juice in there, y'all. Okay? Y'all see that? Look good, don't it? Crust on top, crust in between, and crust on the bottom, honey. It's my favorite part. It's the crust. me on my pre-recorded videos though y'all y'all been showing my channel some love and I and I really do thank y'all all right let's go in here with them here you go grandma I want you to taste this for them that's my cheesecake yeah. mm -hmm. Uh -uh, taste it right now so you can tell them. Mm. Sit it on your lap real quick. Hold on, y'all. Cold. It's going to get done. Just taste it. I'm about to put it right. No, you're going to put it in now. All these damn orders. Well, you, you can't, can't make it get up and dance. What you think? Zero through out of ten. One. Man, I can barely move right now. Zero out of ten. One. Stop playing. One. one slash zero. It's a ten, y'all. Hold on. What you think, Grandma? Uh, yeah, go and taste it for him. Give him some, Grandma. This cheesecake can make you get on your foot and dance. Go and taste it for him. Give him some too now. They want some, Grandma. They want some of yours. You're going to share a little bit. Because they already know you don't like to share, so go and give him some. <laughs> It's right there. Go on, get it to him. She said, come on now. Y'all heard him. Come on, get the stuff. Oh, this is delicious here. Yeah. Mm, mm, they got it, Grandma. Mm. Is it too sweet? Mm. It tastes just right, don't it? It got a, it got enough crust in there for you. <laughs> she had to stop herself, y'all. All right, Grandma, I'm telling you to see him later. I'll see y'all later. Let's finish eating now. They gonna tell you that they love you, Grandma. So I'm gonna tell them. 
All right, and let them know you got something coming for them too. Mm -hmm. Remember the video you did for them. Yeah. Don't tell them what it is, but tell them you got one coming for them. So be looking at. Well, you know, I got one coming for y'all. Mm -hmm. Y'all be looking at now. Hmm. And let me know how you like. I don't know, man. All right, now. Okay. So I don't taste the piece. Oh, okay. All right. So, okay. So, now, one more bite. Y'all see it? If we would have did it in here, it would have been cute too. But I ain't nobody had time. <laughs> ain't nobody had time. It's strawberry cheesecake, no bake. Look at that. I know y'all wanted another piece. Y'all didn't have a piece before you ate. So now this your piece before you go. Mm. Delicious. How you doing? I don't know how they do it, but like, oh yeah, like that. Delicious. All right. So. One more bite for y'all go, cause I know y'all probably said, "Give me one more bite, Tiana. Give me one more." Okay, I got you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. See that potato skin and all. Mmm. Two more, okay. One more. <laughs> all right, they all say they love you too, Grandma. Mm. Oh, you want some on there? Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Alright. I love y'all. Say what now? Who? But Oh, send me the recipe. I don't know, cause I'm. I try. I try. I try. I try. I try. So, I love y'all. Peace, love, and many, many blessings. Girl, you can send it to my email. Tiana, Tiana underscore. I can only be me at hotmail.com. So I love y'all. Peace, love, and many, many blessings to each and every one of you guys. And until, <clears throat> until next time, this just sugar, boo. Tiana, I can only be me. I want to say welcome, 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 welcome. I love you too. To all my new subscribers that have come by here, I'm happy to have y'all. And I will see y'all in the next video. So lucky you, because you stumbled across a channel where I post every day. Every day. Okay, so I love y'all and I and I hope y'all have a great Monday. Don't let nobody change your mood and even on today. Okay, so peace, love, men, and blessings. Till next time. Hey, y'all, it's your girl T. Honor, I can only be me. And I will see y'all on tomorrow. Rest of the video is going to be pre-recorded. And let me go and tell you something. If you don't remember nothing else. 
I thought say this. Remember, uh, ring the doorbell every time you come and watch them pre-recorded videos. If you don't mind ringing the door, doorbell for your girl one more time. Hey, I'm giving y'all time to tell everybody that you love them. You'll see them later. If you don't mind ringing the doorbell. For you girl, one more time, one more time. If you don't mind, ring in the doorbell. For you girl, one more time. If you don't know what the doorbell is, the doorbell is the thumbs up, the like button. Please hit it one time for the one time for your girl. Put the ding on the door and ring the doorbell. Put the ding on the door and ring the doorbell. Put the ding on the door and ring the doorbell. Put the ding on the door and ring the doorbell. Hey, y'all. It's your girl, T. Anna. I can only be me. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 y'all. Hey, 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 y'all. Happy, happy Sunday. How you doing today? How you doing today? How you doing today? How you doing? Hey, how you doing? Hey, how you doing today? How you doing today? How you doing? Hey. tomorrow on pre-recorded for uh, the rest of the week until Thursday all right Tiana underscore I Tiana underscore I can only be me at hotmail.com is my email okay